Hi friends, uh, today I would like to show you some new reporting mechanism which web driver I go uh, created. Its name is uh, Allure Reports. They are very beautiful reports. They are very clear and uh, very nice. Uh, very nice reports I ever seen. Cucumber reports, uh, cucumber HTML module which NPM gives. That's also good. We have seen already in our last tutorials HTML reports. They are nice. But this uh, uh, reports early reports are very beautiful uh, for to get this early reports uh, we we need to run our cucumber feature file as usual so it will generate some reports for us yeah. but when we are running cucumber uh, feature files with web driver we can set up that uh, reporting mechanism uh, options in the configuration file so how can we do that First, first of all, we need a npm module, which is WebDriver I go all your report reporter. We need to download it uh, that to our local. Let's uh, uh, download it to our local. So in my package JSON, I don't have any. So when it, once it is downloaded, it will appear here. WebDriver I go all your report. So yeah, it is downloaded. Cool. So the very next thing we need to do is we need to change our configuration file. Just need to add three lines of code as uh, reporters. What type of reporters we reports we want? Only reports and dot reports. We just need only reports and where to store them. The output directory. So only results directory. So just add that to our web driver our own configuration file. I have added two lines. Reports in a this type. The output folder is this one. We don't have any more. You can see from. So now apart from this, we just need one more tool called Allure command line tool. So we need to download then that one as well. In order to generate reports, so you can download it that one too. Let's just take the G8. I don't want to load that is globally, so I'm loading that one also. So you can see we have downloaded it. We have a little command line tool as well to back up and it. So now I have created some scripts. First, uh, we run our feature file. Let's run with the gulp. I have created a task. So gulp test end to end. So that is my task name. So it will run my feature file. Running now. After finishing feature file execution, it will create a reports folder file, allure results. You can see in this allure results, we will see a lot of JSON files and a, a test suite XML file too. So, what uh, we have to do, we need to take this folder, give it to allure. So then Allure can find it, generate it for us. So in node module, in bin folder, I'm taking Allure from my local. I'm using a keyword called generate. So it will generate reports out of results directory. So and what I'm saying, Allure open. So it will process this uh, JSON files and XML files and creates a very nice beautiful reports and it will open in a browser files. Let's run it. You see, they are very beautiful reports and it's created a your report folder as far as. So let's maximize the scope. As you can see, they are very nice. 
Uh, so yeah, if you're first time, you see certain as your programs, how many test cases run, how long it take. Suites. In the suite, I have that my feature file, and when I take that step, it is showing that it is posted in that private session. If I open this, it shows the request where it is hanging, and it will show response also to us. Very beautiful reports. Uh, that's all for this session. Thank you very much for watching my videos. Uh, please be sub subscribe for for until the link and uh, to get more videos. Yes, thank you.